Hi, today we're going to see how to create a glowing text effect in GIMP. So first let's create a new image by going to File, New. The image width is 1920 and the height is 1080, press OK. Here it is. Press the minus key on your keyboard to zoom out, like this. Make sure the background color is black and the foreground is white since we're going to use the text tool and it's going to use the foreground color. So now left click on the layer to create a new text box and now type your text here like this. Take the alignment tool, left click on this layer, the text layer, and center it on the horizontal and vertical axis by clicking on these two icons. Make sure the align is related to the image here. So now right click on the text layer. Now go layer to image size, duplicate this layer, here it is. And now double click on the name here, and let's name it wind. Press enter to confirm. If you want to remove these squares, just select another tool like this. And now go to the filters tab, distort, wind, here. So as you can see, the settings style is wind, direction left, edge affected leading. And now we're going to increase the threshold to 40 here like this and the strength to 85 like this. It's okay, press, press okay here to confirm. We are going to use all the filters, all the wind, the wind filters on the wind layer here. So let's go back to the filters tab ratio wind here. So this is the wind filter again. Go to presets and now left click here on this arrow here. Last used to give us the previous settings. So just change the direction. As you can see the threshold is 40 and the strength is 85. Press OK. Like this. And now let's go back to the filters tab again. Ratio wind presets, last used, and then the direction is going to be top, press OK. And now for the last time, filters, ratio wind, and now presets, last used, direction, bottom, like this, press OK to confirm. There it is. And now we're going to place the wind layer under the text, the game player, the text layer, the first one. So just click on this small little arrow here, this one here. So as you can see, so here's the wind layer. So here it is. So now we're going to duplicate this layer. We'll give it a glow. So as you can see here, you can even change the mode to screen. So we'll increase the shine here. So let's duplicate it again. Second time, as you can see, it's too much. We're going to decrease the opacity here. I think that's okay here. So now let's hide the dark background layer, the black one here. Hide it. Go to the top layer here. Right click here. And now new from visible. Like this. Here it is. So now you can delete all these layers, previous ones here, like this, here. So now for the new one here, we're going to duplicate it again to increase the shine here, like this. Here it is. Can decrease. I think I, I will keep it like this. So now we're going to merge it down like this with the first one. So here it is, duplicate it again. And now let's go to our filters tab, like this, distorts, kaleidoscope, here, this one, as you can see. Here it is. So now decrease the zoom here to 85. So here it is. Just going to click on the down arrow here, this one, here. So I think that's okay here. So press OK, like this, and now merge down here, 
click on this layer to merge down the text here like this and now create a new layer here we're going to add some colors to this layer here to this text here create a new transparent la layer by clicking on this icon here fill it with transparency press ok and now let's take another color let's take this blue color this one you can take any color you want so here it is and now just drag over the column like this here it is and now let's change the mode to overlay here like this here it is and now if you want to keep the this color text here so hide the background layer here right click on the top layer with the blue color new from visible here like this and now we're going to place this layer the one with the blue color on top of the new visible layer we created here so here it is so now this will increase so as you can see if we hide this one here the previous one it will decrease the the glow here we want to keep the glow and then new from new from visible here now just hide these layers here so that's it that's how we can create a glowing text effect in gimp well thanks for watching have a nice day and uh, till next time bye bye